Hi, in this video I will create abstract title animation slides in After Effects. First, create a new composition and rename it as background. Set the width and height to 1920 to 1080. Create a new solid and rename it as background. Create a new solid and rename it as noise one. Use fractal noise. Change the contrast to 1450 and brightness to minus 600. Change the complexity to 6.5 and in the evolution options, in the random seed, alt and left click, add expression time into 100. That's fine. Next, add posterize time and change it to 6.8. Next, add photo filter and change the filter to custom, change its color to white and density to 100%. Uncheck this preserve luminance. Duplicate this noise. All the things will remain same. Just change the frame rate to 7.3. And in the evolution, change the angle to 150. Now select both these noise layers in the mode and change it to add. Create a new composition and rename it as main comb. Add background to this composition. Write a text like this. And with the help of this shape layer, draw a rectangle and apply some effects on this rectangle shape. First effect we will use is Venetian blinds. Change the transition completion to 15%, direction to 45, and change its width to 80. Next effect, add turbulent displays. Change the amount to minus 350 and change your size to 70. In the evolution options, random seed, alt and left click, add expression, time into 10. That's great. Now make this shape layer below this text and in the track mat, set the track mat to this and change it to Luma mat. And also parent this below shape layer to this one so that it will change its position increase the size and now again duplicate it these two layers by pressing ctrl d and change the track mat set it to no mat and enable this text and change it to some other letter like i'm changing it to w and then select the track mat to this text layer and change it to alpha invert it and move like this. Great. So we have now two text layers that are created. First text will appear at around one minute. And after 20 frames, the second text will appear like this and control shift D to split these layers. So it will look like this. Create a new composition and rename it as text layer 1. Change its width to 1500 and height to 500. With the help of this rectangle tool, draw a rectangle. Center align it, add stroke. And change the fill color to black. Add text. And also center line it. Now add this text layer. It will appear like this. Change its scale, rotation, and make it like appear on 15 frames. Split this text layer. Change its rotation angle like this. Increase your scale and appear it like this. So it will look like this. And when at this point, again, split this text layer, change its angle, 
and it will appear like this. So our text layer, both text layers are ready. Create a new composition and rename it as shape one. Change its width to 500 and height to 1800. And draw a shape. Like this, disable this stroke and change the fill color to white. Use effect Turbulent Displace on this and change the amount to 95. Change its size to 40. Change the position of this Turbulent Offset to the outside of this shape like this. Now keyframe the position like this and at the eight second it will be at the outside. So you can see we have a shape layer. Go back to the main composition, add the shape layer here. Change its angle. Scale like this. And split it. Make it at the top of the text. And change its angle to this. Also. Again split it and change its position like this, increase its scale. So it will appear like this. Great. Now create a new shape layer. Create a new solid and name it as noise 2. Use fractal noise. <laughs> Change the contrast to 2000 and change the brightness from minus 602. Change the evolution angle to 250. And in the evolution options, in the random seat, alt and left click, add expression time into 100. Posture time. And change it to 6. Add photo filter. Change the filter to custom density to 100 and change the color to white. Uncheck this preserved luminosity and in the noise tool mode, change it to add. You can see it's too much visible, so we will decrease its opacity like this and move it here, position like this. Split the text here. Increase your scale. Set rotation to zero. Center align it. Increase your scale. And move it to center. Toggle switches. Enable the motion blur. And set on the scale. Increase the scale like this. And when changing the scale, split this shape layer one and make it appear like here. With the help of this rectangle tool, draw a small rectangle like this. Change its rotation angle. Use effect Venetian blinds. And change and make these changes. Add turbulence displays. Change the amount to minus 360. Size change it to 70. In the evolution options, random seed. Change it to 10. And alt and left click to add expression to random seed. Time into 10. And it will appear like this. Great. So in this way, you can create an abstract style animation 
for title slides and you can make variation on the position of this text and create multiple slides and create your own complete slideshow. If you like the video, please do subscribe and share with others. Till then, I will see you in next video.